Well said. After 40 years as a television news reporter and anchorman, WGAL's Dick Hawksworth did his final news broadcast December 24th. Current and past co-workers, as well as some friends, showed up to honor Hawksworth following the broadcast. Dick will long be remembered for his dedication to timely, fair, and accurate news reporting. I grew up watching Channel 8, and... and, uh, and uh, we had no choice, really, because that was the only station we could get right. on. We weren't, we weren't one of the families who could afford an antenna on the roof. <laughs> so we had rabbit ears, and that was it. So I knew these, pe- these people from coming into our home all the time. And, and the first time, as, as I was, Nelson Sears was taking me around and introduced me to, uh, to Dave Brand, I, I said, uh, nice to meet you, Mr. Brand. He said, he looked at me and with a big smile on that. He said, well, he said, I'll tell you, kid, if we're going to get along, the first thing you're going to have to do is call me Dave. Well, the viewers have been very kind, mm-hmm. inviting me into the, their home, because that's what they do. I mean, you're, you're just a, uh, with the remote, you're just a, you know, a, a thumb movement away from uh, his, being history. Yeah. Uh, but I think it's, it's the fact is that uh, you, you build a trust with the viewer. Uh, you know, and that's that's something that takes time to do. They have they have to trust you. You uh, your credibility goes on the line every day. And I was never comfortable with the celebrity aspect of it uh, because of where I grew up. And this is a business where the ego can, if you don't keep it in check and you're not careful, can get out of control. It's funny, you know, what goes through your mind when I was looking at that, uh, that, that wonderful piece that Susan Shapiro did on, on my career. And there's that, there's that shot of that 12-year-old boy. Uh, I can't help wondering what he would have thought of all this. There are so many people that, that I have to thank for being a part of my life, being a part of my professional life. But most of all, I want to take this time... Uh, this is a lot of that harder than I thought it would be. <laughs> I want to take this time to thank you, the viewer, because nothing that I have done in 40 years would have been possible without you tuning me in, without you inviting me into your home. So I will say for a final time, for Susan Shapiro, Joe Calhoun, and all who made this newscast and so many other newscasts possible, I'm Dick Hawksworth. I wish you well. Goodbye. All set. <laughs>